This is the city, Lakeland, Florida. I work here and I carry a grammar badge. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the story you're about to see is true. The names have been changed to protect the innocent. out of detective headquarters, missing persons division. The boss is Peter Perfect Punctuation. And my partner is Penmanship, but my name is I Wanna Write. We were handling missing punctuation. This was one out of the ordinary. Right. Okay, Miss Ward, we'll be right over. Is that Arbus Wagner? She's reporting a period and a question mark missing. I don't think they were willing we were on our way to speak with Miss Julie Ward, principal of Wagner Elementary. She doesn't rattle easily. Just look at these papers. We are trying to get ready for the FCAT rights here, and look at them. All the periods and the question marks are missing. They've been kidnapped, and I don't know how to get them back. When did you last see them? It was just yesterday. I was here in my office looking at a stack of papers. I came in this morning. All the periods and question marks have vanished. I don't know where they are. My phone's been ringing off the hook. I think they're calling in a ransom on the periods and the question marks. What about the other members of the punctuation family? Well, they all seem to be here. Who are you talking about? Well, there's the comma, the apostrophe, quotation marks, the exclamation point. You might find the rest of the grammar family in the fourth grade classrooms. Let's see if we can find out some clues from the fourth grade teachers. We'll certainly keep you informed, ma'am. Thank you very much, detectives. We talked to one of the school's fourth grade teachers, Miss Williams. We hoped she would lead us in the right direction. The last I saw them was just yesterday. We were having a good old time working on our grammar. I didn't notice anything out of the ordinary, but all of a sudden, someone tells me that two of them are gone. Well, who told you? I heard it from Apostrophe. She's one of the members of the punctuation family. She was whining about how two of them had disappeared. I don't know what the big deal is. They'll turn up eventually. Where can we find this apostrophe? She was here just a minute ago. Maybe she's with the rest of the punctuation family. They like to hang out at the playground when they're not being used. We drove to the playground where the family hangs out. It's obvious to this family that business is business. But after all, they're still kids at heart. Can you give me your name and your purpose? I'm exclamation point. They call me EP for short. I come at the end of an exclamation or exciting sentence, such as, cool, I can't believe I got a dog. We have a dog? Let's stick to the facts. And what do you do? I'm comma. I come during a pause in a sentence. Like, EP, when did we get a dog? Why, the other day, when Mom took us to the pet store. <sighs> Moving along, what is your name and what do you do? I'm quotation mark. QM for short. I come when somebody is speaking mostly near to their face. Like the dog said, whoop. And last but not least, I am apostrophe. We are used to write about something that belongs to someone, like our dog's name is Capital. Did anything out of the ordinary happen? We've been all over the campus. The media center, checking out all the neat stuff in there. The office, getting some encouraging words from Mrs. Ward. And then we went to Miss Williams' class. And Just the facts, ma'am. But do you have any idea of who would want to kidnap your siblings? Bad Grammar Betty has been seen around campus, and she's wanting to take us all out so that kids won't do their best on the FCAT. Where can we find this Bad Grammar Betty? She's been lurking around the fourth grade buildings. And why is that? Because lots of riding has been taking place there. Maybe we should pay another visit to the fourth grade wing. We headed back to the fourth grade for more information. But as we walked in, the custodian was cleaning, and she really seemed agitated. What's the problem, ma'am? Someone sure left a mess around this school. I've been picking up these questions and periods. Questions and periods? 
May I see one? Interesting. Could these be clues? That's exactly what I was thinking. Maybe it's a trail. Just where have you found these? I have picked these up on the sidewalk, the cafeteria, and all the way to the media center. I'm headed there next. Well, have you seen this person? Yes, I've seen her today. I saw her walking down the sidewalk this morning headed to the media center. It looks like that is our next stop. And I hope it's our last one too. On our way to the media center, we were hoping to question Bad Grammar Betty on the whereabouts of question mark and period. Stop! In the name of the law! Can we help you? Have you seen question mark and period? Why, no. Are they missing? Yes, for quite some time. Me know nothing about it. Me never saw they before. Funny, because the custodian mentioned seeing you with them. She be wrong. These look familiar. Where does that door lead to? Me? Don't know. Me gotta go. Me late for a meeting. You are not going anywhere until we see what's in that room. Do you have a key or shall we call the custodian? Busted. Oh, thank you, thank you. Bad Grandma Betty kidnapped us and left us in this room. And made us watch TV until our brain turned to mush. Why'd you kidnap us? Me didn't want those whiz kids doing good on the FCAT. Times are tough. Me didn't want to lose me job. Me have kids to feed. Kids or no kids, what you did was wrong. Now you have to pay. Booker pin. Are you finished with us now? We need to get back to our family and back to our job. Too many students depend on us. Yes, you may go. We're done here. While Bad Grammar Betty was taken to police headquarters, life at Wagner returned normal. The punctuation family could be seen in classrooms, helping the students improve their writing.